starting. Hello and welcome to my ballet YouTube site. I'm a ballet teacher for 30 plus years and I'm going to show you how to massage your feet for health, happiness, and a greater stretch. First start by applying an arnica lotion. Massage areas of your feet such as your arch and your intrinsic muscles. I use a t-bar tool so my hands don't get too fatigued. Go gently all over the bottom and top of your foot. In particular, massage the muscles between your toes and the front of your ankle where it meets your shin. Both of these areas, if worked on regularly, will increase ankle and foot mobility plus flexibility, which leads to a better looking foot. You can vary the pressure of the tool. You don't have to go extra hard with the tool. In fact, I have done that mistakenly and actually bruised myself. And I found that my PT sometimes does a very light touch and it works just as well. You can repeat this as many times as you need to. Sometimes you'll find a little trigger and point in there and you'll have to go back over it. You can move along up to your calves, especially on the outside and outer side of your calves and shins. These take a beating with releves and jumping. They need to be strong, but they also need to be mobile and not have any tightness in them. You'll find the knots. Your body will let you know. Another great option besides a t-bar tool or your thumbs and hands which gets tired is to use your elbow for your calves and arches. I love this lotion though. It goes on really smoothly and the arnica, like I said, provides an anti-inflammatory property. So continue along your calves, hopefully finding them getting looser and finding those little tight trigger points all along around your ankle, etc. Lightly, not too hard. But to see where there might be some points of holding from your ballet technique. Then I take my foot and I twist it right and left. Yeah, I do stickle it, I do turn it evert in and out just to keep again the mobility happening. Try some pointing, flex your toes, help them out by pulling them back. And I finish up with a light massage with my runners tool which is called the stick. A lot of dancers have this. They're great. I really like the short one that I have there for women because I can reach my shoulders. It's not too long. Then I stand up and just kind of finish up by lightly going over my instep, pressing up on the metatarsals and stretching. I take a final look at those metatarsals. Are any of those little bones recessed and not really freed up yet? If so, Go ahead and do a little more massage between those muscles so you can keep them moving and helping out. Your body works best if everything is smoothly flowing. I hope you enjoyed this. Please check out my new ebook to all my accidental artist friends.